There's something in the air and it's headed straight for Okaloosa County. But what's brewing is not mm. weather related this time. News 13's Peyton Lo Cicero tells us it's the chefs who are stirring the pots. The flavors, the medley of seafood, and the delicious smells of gumbo have taken over the atmosphere here in Okaloosa County as 10 local chefs compete for this trophy for best gumbo on the Emerald Coast. The 8th annual First City Bank's Gumbo Cook-Off brought nearly 400 people together for a flavorful event. And uh, this has morphed into something that is just incredible. All of the restaurants came ready to serve and eager to win, but one team came with their game faces on and turned up the heat. We are here with the Crab Trap to defend our title and to win it once again. We decided to partner up with a charity and now all the proceeds uh, go to a charity that's near and dear to my heart. So not only did people go home with their bellies full, but they went home with happy hearts, knowing they were helping make a difference in the community. The local nonprofit is called Fresh Start for Families and Children. What we do is help homeless families or families that are facing homelessness. Whatever their barrier might be, we come alongside them and help them get over that. So we like to say it's a hand up, not a hand out. As a judge, I was looking for spiciness within my Gumbo. After three hours of tasting, the judges deliberated and have a winner. We were here to win. You know, gumbo is just a labor of love, and the love came through tonight and shined, and uh, we're just really happy and very pleased to be a part of this uh, community and a part of this, uh, this event. This year's gumbo cook-off raised more than $6,000 for Fresh Start families and children. I'm News 13's Peyton Lo Cicero, Panhandle Strong.